Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the ISR Racing League. This week we're in Spain. This is Zach here taking over for Toby as his microphone is not working properly. And so I'm going to be covering this week's highlights of the Spanish Grand Prix. Well with the China Grand Prix over, the Sonic X49, Memphis and Kokoraki incidents have been considered racing incidents and no further action will be taking place. So this means that Memphis will be trying to take a win away from Excovo, who managed to sneak a win last week at China and Spain is looking to be one of those races. This was one of those tracks that was on the testing calendar and so everybody would be trying to get as much fast laps as they could. And everybody was getting frustrated in the pre-week practice, mainly ex Kobo and Welsh Sniper Spen, because they were really getting annoyed by the lack of flow through the last chicane. So well, that chicane will probably be putting into a lot of trouble with this week. But um, in qualifying, Kokoraki managed to get a pole. That's right. So with that being said, can he be able to get the race win from the pole? And can anybody else catch him? Ex Kobo looking to try to get another win this season. So maybe it should play out very well. In all in all, it's going to be a very fantastic race here at Spanish Grand Prix at the Circuit de Catalunya. Let's get to the race highlights.
over the white line when coming out of the pit, or you'll get a penalty. The car fitted with wet tyres. You've got one scheduled stop left. The car behind is on standard revs. Car behind is running standard revs.
So that is it, ladies and gentlemen. The Spanish Grand Prix is over as ex Cobalt manages to take another win this season, beating out Kokoraki, who takes a controversial second place, as him and Raymond's, who is his was first race of his career with the ISR, comes home third. They collided in one of the corners, and that is under a steward's investigation. More news to come later at Monaco. GL8991 finishes fourth, and fifth place goes to Memphis. Galactic Skull 2 finishes 7th, 6th, uh, Andrew P88 7th, Evanzo 7, who also made his debut this week, finishes 8th, Welsh Sniper Spen has a DNF as he disconnected while battling X Cobalt, and also Super Big Layer 1 with a DNF. Looking at the point standings right now, X Cobalt takes the lead away from Memphis, who has a 7 point lead over him with 108 points, Memphis in 2nd with 96 points, GL8991 with 52 points in 3rd, 4th, Galactic Skull 2 with 44 points, not able to make the race this week, 5th place in Sonic X49 with 40 points. Boy Sniper Spin with the disconnection is in 6th with still with 37 points. Super Brick Layer 1 is in 7th with 29 points. Kogaraki is in 8th with 28 points. Making, also making this race debut is Raymond's with ninth, uh, in 9th with 15 points. And in 10th is Dougie Afterman with 11 points. 11th is Andrew P88 with 6 points. And Ivanzo 7 with 6 points in 12th. So, with Monaco in the next race in the calendar, the all glamorous Monaco Grand Prix in the streets of Monaco, will the controversial second place finish for Kokoraki kind of make things a little bit more harder for him to even make a decent points finish, or can he shake it off? And also, can Memphis be able to catch Gix Kobo and try to retake the points lead? We will all find out next week at Monaco. But until then, guys, this has been the ISR Race Highlights, and thank you for watching.